<laughs> With the gradual reopening of schools, a possibility no one is willing to rule out. The government faces a big challenge to achieve social distancing in learning institutions. Education CS Professor George Magoa says classes should be no larger than 20 learners should schools reopen. We have been advised by the Minister of Health that the class should have between 15 and 20 children. To fit the new arrangement, Professor Magoa's announcement implying that the current arrangement of classes with at least 50 learners must be reorganized. Even with the Basic Education Act of 2016 outlining that a normal class size should hold 50 learners, some schools experience overloaded classrooms. At Olympic Primary School in Kibra, for instance, some streams carry over 100 learners per class, conducting a normal assembly a heavy task. How possible will it be to achieve the proposed 1.5 meters distance between pupils? You know, and I know, and everybody knows in this country that that is going to be a challenge. The more reason why we must make sure that the masks are made of good materials. That is going to be a challenge, but it will not stop us from moving forward. In the budgetary allocation to the Ministry of Education to mitigate the effects of COVID-19 pandemic, 2.1 billion shillings for the construction of additional classrooms has been allocated. 1.9 billion shillings has also been allocated to provide at least 250,000 locally fabricated desks for both secondary and primary schools. But this may not be achieved at once by September 1st. Professor Magoa has announced a raft of measures. The government is developing uh, a system where teachers must come maybe two weeks before so that they are trained on how to deal with COVID-related cases. There are thermoguns which are not expensive, which we hope a school will have several, so that we are able to pick and the teachers will be taught how to, to use this. There are proposals to conduct classes partially among groups where some classes may either be allocated some periods within a day or hours. This is to help reduce contact in learning institutions by having fewer learners at the same time for greater impact in reducing COVID-19 cases and fatalities associated with the reopening of institutions. And as the countdown towards September 1st continues, Magoa says achieving social distancing in schools remains a tall order. This even as the government seeks to combat the spread of coronavirus among students. Makori Citizen TV, Nairobi.